Okay, here, let's just bring this over here. So how do sets between these guys usually go? Is it, is it just a bunch of habit reading or what? Well, <laughs> I'm sure a tournament game is going to be a lot different from our usual friendly. Oh, they're going to they be taken seriously, not just... Well, yeah, this is this is everything on the line. This is uh, two equally matched competitors. <laughs> Going to P stab first, it seems. So I'm pretty sure Zelda can like up throw into like a bunch of other matches against that Falcon, right? Yeah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Good forward air stuffing him out. Good tech. Ooh, it's a good match. I'm just make it back at the sweet spot too. Mm -hmm. Ooh, yeah, he, he definitely de added for that. Escape the Nair surprisingly. Oh, he missed the knee. Yeah, he definitely missed his jump. Mm -hmm. Oh, I got a premature up smash there. I'm not sure why that was. Here we go. Good forward tilt into up tilt. Good pop. Uh, up. I, yeah, Good I, patience I, on the shield. Definitely. Exactly. A lot of people, a lot of people, just drop their shield strangely. <laughs> Some wild neutral going on on B Bros, man. Yeah. <laughs> That's the thing about him. He'll always do like all this crazy stuff. And you won't, you, you never see it, so you'll never know exactly how to approach it. <laughs> Ooh, man. Let's take another back here. Yeah, a bit unsafe on that back here. Keeping his distance. Oh, B Bro found his way in. Didn't capitalize on the tech yeah. Oh, we got it back. We were going for the safe recovery. Movement mix-ups here. <laughs> oh, almost. Oh, you found a knee. <laughs> a couple moments Man, where it could have like been grabs. Looking serious mind games going on. Oh, okay, that was awesome. Oh, that was a crazy boy build. Okay. Play, yeah. Playing a bit scared, I think. Uh, Def April? Definitely uh, on, on both ends a little bit. Definitely. Uh, they were just up, a yeah, up in each other's face just like a second ago. <laughs> kind of. Oh, and now that, yeah, that was pretty risky. Oh. That's surprising if the up to leaving hit. Oh, yeah. Wasn't expecting yeah. the, the gentleman to so get yeah. hit out of there. Oh, he actually finds right, back here. Uh, uh, Alpha's kind of taking a lead here. He's yeah, pretty still. even going back and forth here. So much space. Yeah. Finding down tilt down smash, the Bebo classic. <laughs> oh, unsafe dash tag. He's trying to catch him coming from above, yeah. but he's not finding it. I think in the yeah, viewer just needs to get him off stage. Like, he doesn't necessarily need to like, land a kill move here. Just get him off stage and then just try to get him. Oh. Too slow on the draw there. Mm -hmm. Oh, finds a downer again. Definitely reading those dash tech approaches now. Mm -hmm. Oh, I messed up his inputs. Yeah, you click at the go for here. Oh, reverse back here. It's definitely going for the regular one, but. Oh, not gonna kill. That's exactly what he's trying to catch. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Mr. Alpha Dog takes game one. <laughs> so this is uh, best of five. That's right. Every uh, everything top is best of five. I see, we, got, I see. we got plenty of time, so okay. Why not? <laughs> got some super duper thinking going on here. Some real mind trickery. Some tomfoolery. Um. 
I think the platforms help uh, have Falcon more than they do uh, Zelda, wouldn't they? Like, he's just very accustomed to platforms. I think he feels more comfortable having them versus without. Okay. Because he, he's not so much a person that will try and juggle you and tech chase on platforms. He, he's more of like, get you on a platform, you'll miss a tech, and then he'll oh. get the damage. Oh yeah, get an air or something in there, huh? Yeah. Like, Nair's very good at following on the platforms as well. Yes, yeah, it definitely takes up, occupies a lot of space. Oh, here we go, let's see this edge guard. Oh, I didn't okay. went for jab. I think, uh, I think down smash would have killed, actually. <laughs> Up here? Oh, he's too slow. Almost it, def it definitely would have comboed if, if he uh, didn't double jump, I think. Just yeah. the one jump. Ooh, there you go. Yeah, he finds the kill. Yeah, B-Bro's leaving now. Oh, it hits him out of it. Oh, goes for the goes for the up tilt. I like that. Yeah, that, I mean, that, that was a very good call. Time, time to right and everything. Hesitated on the edge guard, looks like. No narrow cutter. He's kind of waiting for B-Bro to come in. Yeah. Seems to be working, though. He's definitely stuffing B-Bro's approaches. Let's see if he has an answer for it. Mm -hmm. no, it's, yeah, it's just... Do we sit to neutral? Oh. Okay. Get off smash. Oh, he goes for a, goes for a hard read instead yeah. of something more safe. Yeah, there we go. There, there's a new there. Oh, this is wild. Yeah, after he's no, oh, still alive. Oh, get the. Oh well. All right then. I mean, still not a bad trade. <laughs> Everything just kind of resets. So yeah, Elias is a stock behind, so he's going to be looking to take the stock as soon as possible. Yeah, he's going to be getting in here. Goes for a read on the tech roll in. Ooh, all right. Like the button there, but he needed to back off there. I'd like to see him uh, play a bit more reactionary to get more guaranteed damage. Wow, he's just... Yeah. I think he could have got a backer. But I, I, I think what Bieber was trying to go for was uh, yeah, yeah, well, I don't, drag the neutral Whatever was going on there, that was cool. Yeah, he was trying to he was trying to drag him with the neutral air and then get an up on a platform. It's like some Zelda shit that I do. Oh, yeah? <laughs> I feel like I won't kill yet. Oh, good up. Fair. Definitely intercepted everything. Yeah. Oh, oh, down air. That, that, that won't kill, though. Um, I think Bieber had the right idea going off stage. Oh, that, yeah, I think that's it. Alright, so he took the stock, so he, he can't really get hit off stage now at this point. He needs to take as much chip damage as he can. So he can either take the stock next stock, or if he can potentially just take it this stock. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, uh, that'll yeah. do it, I think. <laughs> yeah, Nuchlar can definitely get crouch cancelled. Looks like Bieber was waiting for that. Oh, I think he messed up the up here. Playing a bit more safer, got the got the pivot aerials. Yeah, he definitely needed that tech. Oh, that was not intentional. He's gonna take a hefty bit of damage for this. Good out edge cancel. That was interesting. Ooh. Definitely going in. Uh, I'm not so sure about that. I think I think going he, further he, in he the stage was the right idea. Oh yeah, that was a that was a knee definitely. I don't think he was ready for that though. Unfortunately. Oh. Yeah, Zelda. Jeez. Bebo definitely has has a sizable lead here. If yeah. he gets like a straightforward air attacker, definitely. Yeah, lead into something. Yeah. He's getting first hit neutral air like six times. Oh my god. Oh, just going in. Let's let's see. I, I'd like to see He's more uh, wave dash bash from Bebo. Yeah. I, I feel like he, he can to... he can catch catch some uh, good F tilts if he just uh, applies the proper space. Yeah, he, he, I think he just needs to he needs to like regain the well, the pace of the match here. Like he's just oh, yeah. he's the match. yikes! Oh, that's too bad. Looks like Elias is uh, really taking control of when that when uh, Bebo starts throwing out the dash attacks. Mm -hmm. Seems Punch. to know when they're coming. Exactly, just shields it and punches. As he should. I 
I like this pick. Um, mm -hmm. Zelda, Zelda definitely, I think, is his favorite here. Yeah, I'd like to see a bit more down throw use. Yeah, exactly. It se seems like there's a <clears throat> seems like there's a bit more damage to to be had out of that than up throw. Up throw generally will only. It's, it's something you do against uh, like semi fast walls and fast walls. I think. Yeah, it, it, it will it will work on Zelda though at times like only at uh like lower percent, right? Yeah, kind of like around twenty percent, and then it'll work again around like seventy. It'll go into like up throw knee. Mm -hmm. But that won't that won't be of any use on this stage for sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I see Bibro attacking. Uh, Elven Shield a lot too. It's something that um, can be capitalized more on. If he's expecting the shield, then he could do uh, like a neutral B and then immediate grab, or right. he can even just tomahawk. For example. <laughs> Not dead. I think. I... Oh, it doesn't uh, get the Oh no! Damn. Missing those crucial sweet spots. Mm -hmm. There we go. Good grab. See, right there would have been uh, good for down throw, I think. You have to have uh, like really tight timing if you want to get an actual combo fall up off of up throw. Yeah. Otherwise, you'll just be catching a jump or, yeah. or just missing altogether. Ooh, I was expecting a dash attack to be honest. Mm -hmm. But it's okay, he's off stage. Bit too slow on the draw there. Good up air, he wasn't able to react to that. <laughs> Are you oh, oh, spot oh, dodge. I, I feel like that was an accident. He probably meant to wave dash out of shield. This looks like he has a pretty good lead here. I think the space of the stage is a bit more advantageous for Alpha because he's uh, he's more comfortable with the space with Falcon. Right. I mean, yeah, I suppose so. He can just kind of. Yeah, Zelda can live longer, but because Falcon has uh, like, oh, like the kill power, you know. Still, yeah, still, yeah, heavily slanted towards Falcon's favor in that, in that uh, respect. Oh, that was surprising. Yeah, Uppy certainly is not invincible. He has some good edge guards so far. Oh, oh that's it. All right. Oh, man. <laughs> All right. Uppy is on. <laughs>